Hi everybody, it's Night Fear and I have a Dollar Tree, Hobby Lobby, Ollie's, and Dollar General haul. I have a very little bit from each one so I thought I'd just combine it all instead of doing several little videos. I thought I'd do a, a big one. Um, it is Saturday so Christopher and Kaylin are home so you might hear Christopher and Kaylin is going to be joining me here in a few minutes but she is busy right now. So I went to two different Dollar Trees and found um, a few different things at the different Dollar Trees. He can come, Kalen, he can come in if he wants. Um, and so I thought I would share what, what I found. So the first thing, this is a repeat buy. I got the cocoa butter, the moisturizing body lotion. This smells really good and works really good. And it's from Dermacell. So if you guys have this at yours, um, I definitely would recommend. Um, my fiance uses it a lot. So I, I usually buy one or two a month for him. So, um, Kaylin. Um, I also got um, two packs of these, the peppermint bark. Um, the last time I was there, they had peppermint bark, but they were candy bars. Um, Kaylin already got into this. I haven't had one yet. I did. Were they good, Kaylin? You had one of these? Or was it David that took it? Oh, it might have been my son, David. But anyway, so they're little bitty pieces. I guess she's going to try one out. So they're little bitty pieces, and they're the, the dark chocolate... Um, with the white chocolate and the, the peppermint. So, I don't know. I haven't tried them yet. I was hoping to find the candy bars, but oh well. These are what I found. So this is one. Oh, see, look. look. See, this is Kaylin. Show them what it looks like. See? So you've got the peppermint. And <laughs> let Christopher have a bite. Wait. You no. Know. There's, there's Christopher, everybody. Bite. Good. Yummy. Christopher, is it yummy? <laughs> I think he likes it. Okay. Um, I also found this book, Filler on the Roof. Um, it's actually, it's not like novel. It's almost like like a script kind of or like a play. So I, I don't have any books like this. Um, but I love to read and I love Filler on the Roof. So we're going to try this and see how it goes. Um, easy, Christopher. I also have... Um, this zipper seal bag that um, my fiance actually found for me. And um, so I got this. It has snowflakes. Um, so this would be great to use with Happy Mail so I can stick stuff in there. Um, it's very pretty. Oops. Um, but yeah, so got that. Um, let's see what next. Um, I found these stickers. And they're really pretty. There's one page that have the the glitter, and then the rest of them are just the plain. And they're pretty similar stickers on every page, kind of. There's a little so this bit of different. Dark chocolate. Yeah, the bottom is dark chocolate. Um, so yeah, so you, you see can't the even different. Taste the dark chocolate. Um, so there you go. So you get quite a few stickers in here for a dollar. And then I got, haha, <laughs> I found these candles, and these are the um, cupcake candles, and these are the toasted coconut, and they smell so good. Um, they only had the toasted coconut and the raspberry filled. I didn't think the raspberry filled smelled really strong, um, but um, I have seen where people have said these have a really good throw, so I'm going to try these toasted coconut, and I love coconut, which is why I bought two. And this was actually not at my Dollar Tree. This was at the Dollar Tree across town, so my Dollar Tree did not have any the one that's close to me really stinks when it comes to candles. And actually, I was surprised to find these at the one I went to. So, but yeah, these smell so good. Okay, oh, I actually got um, found this one too at the same Dollar Tree. Um, it's the strawberry and cream. It's the old Williamsburg candle, um, the mason jar, the small mason jar one. So, and this smells really, really good. So, I'm hoping this one has a good throw too. Um, from what people have told me. The Williamsburg candles, or from what I've seen on YouTube, I'm sorry, um, Williamsburg candles usually have a pretty good throw. So we'll see. Okay. Um, I saw people hauling these <clears throat> and I found them. Um, I'm not sure how many colors they are, but I found two packs and these are the glitter markers and I've got the red and blue and the green and 
gold and I thought they would be pretty for um, pocket letters or different you stuff. I don't know. Shake it first? I don't know. We're gonna try to play with them and see. We'll play with them and, and see. It says um, shake, push, and then draw. Yeah, we'll try and see. Um, and then I, I have been seeing everybody haul um, all these great, awesome coloring books. And my Dollar Tree did not have these great, awesome adult coloring books. But I did find these two, and it's by Colorful. And this one is Gardens and Flora. And this one is Rainforest. Um, and they're really cool. Kaylin started coloring... Um, one I told her she could color one so she started coloring um in that and that's as far as she got because I put up my pencils I use my Prismacolor pencils and she I let her use them sometimes too so but anyway so those are the the books and this one's just mostly you know flowers and plants mm -hmm. and um stuff like that and <clears throat> this one is rainforest and so it's got, you know, rainforest animals and um, stuff like that. And I just thought it was it would be something different and neat to color. I really like coloring books, guys. I, I really... Yes, she does. I really like coloring books. Maybe at the end of the video I'll show you um, what I've been coloring lately. Okay, speaking of coloring books, I also saw people haul coloring books at, from Dollar General. Um, <laughs> so I went and found some really nice ones. I found this one, which is actually, it's stickers that you color. Um, and if you look, see, like these are flowers, but they're stickers. You peel them off. Yeah. Um, and they're really cool. It's got all different <gasps> kinds of. But, okay, look, Kaylin, you can look at it in a minute, baby. And it's got, like, really inspiring little sayings and stuff, too. See? So I could color that and, like, put it in a planner or stuff like that. Well, see, you should have come with us. Kaylin came. We went out yesterday, and Kaylin... She went home, or no, I guess this is before, this is before you were off school, I guess. Hmm. Um, so anyway, I got this one here. You can look at it. And then I got this one. It's Deep Sea Secrets. And I think this one was $3. I think that the la the sticker one was $3 too. Um, so Deep Sea Secrets, and this is just, you know... Um, sea creatures and nautical stuff and boats and there's a narwhal. <laughs> close, close unicorn. Mustaches! Um, but it's just, it's kind of a cutesy little book and I thought I'd have fun coloring mustaches. it, so. Um. Are you going to be using the mustaches anytime soon? Um, I don't know, Kaylin. Why? Do you want one of the mustaches? Yeah. So anyway, there's Deep Secrets. And then I got, let's see this one which is home is where the heart is and this one was also three dollars and this yeah. one's just kind of it's a it, it's not really a difficult coloring book it's kind of another kind of cutesy one um but i thought i'd have fun coloring some of this stuff um see there's ties i thought that would be kind of fun to color and there's all the shoes um makeup Donut. Yeah, there's <clears throat> cupcakes, different cooking stuff. And there's animals. Look at the dogs and cats. Those are cute. Aww. And the flowers. There's strawberries. That would be a fun page to color. For you. Yeah, for me. I like strawberries. But yeah, it's just a lot of fun, different things. And this was also... I think I don't know if I said this or not. This was also $3. So, I mean, it seems expensive, but if you look... Let me see. It doesn't... It's covered it. Oh, it's usually normally... I can see it under the sticker. It's normally fourteen ninety five, so three dollars isn't bad. All right, and then I have I don't have any Christmas ones, so I bought this one, the Holly Jolly Christmas, and it's it's five. It was five dollars. It was a little bit on the expensive, or more expensive side of the ones I got, but it's just got all different you can kinds of. The front page. It's all different kinds of um, different Christmas stuff and. I thought this would be fun to start coloring for Christmas. But yeah, I thought it was really pretty. There's your reindeer, Christmas trees, Santa Clauses. Oh, that one's pretty. That one is really pretty. 
If I could figure out how to do snow with my pencils and do the snow, that would be really pretty. You need white, gray, and blue. Probably. And I think you're supposed to put your name in here. Like, it, you know, it's your... You can color kind of, this. Um, yeah, you might be able to. I don't think I will. But, yeah, you probably could. But anyway, and then I got... This is the one I'm most excited for because I see, I watch a lot of coloring people on YouTube. And a lot of people have um, Joanna Basford's coloring book, um, a lot of her books. And I guess if some people have been finding the, ma I think it's Magical Ocean or Ocean, Ocean something. Um, they didn't have the, that one at this Dollar General, but I did ha find the Magical Jungle. So I'm really excited that I have one of her coloring books, um, and I will try it out and see if I like it and maybe get some more. Oh, look at the the birds. A hummingbird? I like no, they're not hum. Yeah, no, I thought they were hummingbirds at first, but they're not. They're um, um, parrots. Yeah. Um, because this is a jungle, so it's got more elephants and there's chameleons and um different things like that so this is a different kind of coloring book I'm just trying to see which um, <clears throat> people that I like the artists that I like and then oh that's a beautiful butterfly that's going to be fun to color um, and then I can see what I like and what I don't and then I can buy more of the people that I like so but yeah there's coloring okay and then I went to Ollie's I love Ollie's <laughs> They didn't really have any coloring books that I liked there, but I did find some, um, this is Nina paper, and they have all these different colors in here, um, and I thought those would be neat for some spring pocket letters maybe, or, I don't know, different crafting stuff, so I bought this, and of course, it was only $1.99, as you can see from Ollie's. Um, if you guys really, if you've never been to an Ollie's and you have one close, you really need to go. Books, paper, they also have, I mean, especially now, Christmas time, if you have kids, they they have all kinds of toys and all kinds of different stuff. Um, then my, oh, one of my twin sons was with me and he picked this out and I told him he's not getting it now. I'm going to wrap it and put it under the tree. So uh -huh. he's really, really into Star Wars. Yes, so I got, yeah, I got him this, um, and it's so hard. I mean, he's 19, almost 20, and it's just, it's so hard to buy for them. Um, but anyway, he was with me and picked that out. And then I found, I only found two books. I got, um, this one, The Secrets of Solace by Jaylee Johnson. Um, more of, it's more of a fantasy book and it was only $1.99. So at $1.99, I figured I'd try it and see if I like it. And this is Furthermore, um, oh goodness gracious, by Tahara Moffey. And this is like a retelling of Alice in Wonderland. And this one was also only $1.99. So I'm waiting. They have a lot of Stephen King books there. And so I've been waiting to see if it will manage to make it there. Because I don't have... I used to have that one. And I don't have that one anymore. And his newest one. Um, is it Sleeping Beauties? I think it's called. Or something like that. Um, I want that one too. Of course. Because I don't... You know, I'm trying to collect all of Stephen King's books. But so I figured... Who, are Who are you? I don't know, baby. I haven't read it yet. So I bet I figured I'd, I'd, I'd get this book. Okay, mm -hmm. that's all I got from Ollie's, and then I went to Hobby Lobby, because, you know, I love Hobby Lobby, and I haven't been there in a while, and so I bought, da, 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 come on, get out of the bag, thank you, Kaylin. Um, guys, if you go to Hobby Lobby, make sure you check out their sale section, their clearance section, because, whoops, hold on, I got... 50 sheets of 12 by 12 paper for $3.59. That is a deal and deal, deal, deal. Of course, you're not supposed to open them, but most of the time if you watch, people have already opened them. And But look at the beautiful paper. I mean, look at that. I love that one. Isn't that pretty? And then the, I like that one. the tree paper. I thought, oh, since Christmas is coming for Christmas pocket letters. Um, so, and then I got a... 
last time I went to Walmart, I got a um, 12 by 12 cutter. So now I can cut 12 by 12 paper easier. And so, yes. So those of you that I send pocket letters to, you might be getting some new papers. Now, if I ever trade, um, you know, do a swap with you guys with pocket letters and you see paper that you like, just let me know. And I'm, I'm you know, all, I'm down for sending you guys some paper, you know, cutting it up in, you know, the little... Um, pocket letter size and just sending it to you. I don't mind sharing. Um, so, okay. And then I got, what else did I get? Oh yeah. These stickers that are color stickers. They're owls. I got me some of these, but they were butterflies. And a uh, dollar 24. I mean, who can go wrong? A dollar and 24 cents. It's like, you know, Dollar Tree prices almost. And then I got, um, my fiance actually found these for me too. They're the same ones, but I went ahead and got two of them because they're different and I've never seen them. And they were actually a dollar oh seven. Once again, Dollar Tree prices, but it's the duct tape brand, and I just thought it was really pretty. You know, it's a different color, little leopard spot, spot ones. So I got two of those, and I love my Happy Planners. Um, I have a big one that was an 18 month and I am still good with that one, but, oh, put that over there. but as you can see, you, this you is my this? old, yes, this is my old planner that I've been using. Now these are the big rings. If you can see, these are the, these are the small rings, right? And so those are the large rings. And as you can see, this thing is like full. But I use it. I mean, I use it. I put all my, all the kids stuff in here. I put all, you know, all the um, doctor's appointments I have, all the doctor's appointments the kids have, all of that. And it's just getting too full. Um, I still have a few months left in there, but I thought I'm not, I'm not going to do this. I'm going to buy another one. So I looked at the planners and I found this one and I thought it was gorgeous because of the blue and the rose gold. Uh, and it was nineteen ninety nine, so not all that much. Um, Twenty bucks. But it's just, I mean, it's just really pretty, and just the, you know, the colors, the blue and the, the rose gold. See, it's not about having time; it's about making time. I mean, just the beautiful. I like that. Yeah, because Kaylin's favorite color is blue. So, um, but it says "Live a life of endless wonder," and you can see, see down here. It's all pretty much rose gold, but it's hard to get on camera. But you can kind of see right here, right in here, the rose gold. And it's just gorgeous. So, yeah. And all the the smaller Happy Planners have the um, horizontal. Um, and it's easier for me to just write. Like I said, this one is just for appointments. My other planner, I do my budget and do other things in it. So... But I got this. I like this a lot. And I got the gold rings because I know it's going to look like my other one. And so these little rings are not going to be good. So I got the bigger rings. And the bigger rings are, um, they're only uh, $4.99. Um, and you can actually make your own happy planners with just the rings. You know, and if you use your 40% off at Hobby Lobby, they're not that much. You can make so. your own rings too, can't you? No, you can't make your own rings. So, um, so pretty much that's it, guys. I'm going to show my coloring real quick. So, for those of you that don't want to see my coloring, thank you for stopping by. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys in my Imagine Morphia book. This is the very first um, pages. I'm actually doing a buddy, what they call a buddy color. And so, I'm coloring with somebody that I met on one of the Facebook groups. And it's wonderful. And so this is the picture that I'm coloring. I'm almost done. Just pretty much have the balloons to do. So, but I'm really enjoying um, this book. Um, it's, I mean, it's a lot of the pages are, there's a lot of stuff on them. Like this one. You know, it's really complicated. And I actually got this um, book at uh, Walmart. It was like nine something. Um... So, I mean, it was a little on the expense, more expensive side of the coloring books that I buy. Um, but it's just, oh, I cannot wait to color this butterfly. Um, but if you guys would like 
be I, I mean there are a lot of people that do their coloring books and stuff if you guys oh and I see I've colored a couple things here um but if you guys want me to you know do anything with my coloring books or whatever just let me know and you know I don't mind doing that put that put the papers back down I do that so that the it doesn't okay and I use my clipboard my Dollar Tree clipboard to lean on but they're just they're so they're really awesome um books and you actually um it's kind of like a hunt you know like a would you call it a picture find or whatever? And they have pictures in the back that you're supposed to find. So the one I'm coloring now, the one I'm coloring now, I actually found this, so I colored it the same way I colored it in the in the picture. Um, but see, isn't that gorgeous? The the eagle. Um, what does the fun? And he actually has. Um, this is a Magimorphia. He has Mythomorphia and Anamorphia. The Mythomorphia doesn't have a lot of these little characters. It's and it's like unicorns, she dragons. Wants it because she has a unicorn. Oh yeah, there's a gorgeous unicorn picture in there. I don't have it yet. My son actually has it. My other son Robert, he actually has it. Um, and then Anamorphia is all animals. Isn't that ow awesome? Yeah, no, and the the tail, well tail. Um, but like I said, if you guys want me or if you guys like to color, and any of you want to do a buddy color, um, we can get on. Um, Facebook Messenger, or we can do it by email, or however you want to do it, and um, we can uh, color together and chat and do something like that. Um, so I'm not sure who all of you guys color. I do have, I do have several coloring books, but not a lot of the higher end like this one. There's a shark. That one I can't wait to color either. I love sharks. Um, so anyway, um, I'm glad you guys stayed to the end of the video. Um, and, uh, yeah, I know. Look at the little guy. He's so cute. Um, but, uh, I am still thinking about having a giveaway. I'm almost at a hundred. Um, so if you guys want a giveaway, you guys are going to have to let me know what kind of stuff you'd like me to give away and I will see what I can do. So Kalen, you have anything you want to say? Oh, Kaylin wants to show you a couple of her pictures. Really quick, Kaylin, because we're already at almost 30 minutes. And that book, this book we actually got, she actually got from the Dollar Tree also a while back. So, oh yeah, there's her leopard and her bear. I love her bear. Yeah, she does pretty well. Her book and her clothes. She's still not finished with this yet. Yeah, her cat. And her dog. Her dog is so cute. And that's it. Yep. Okay. So we just want to tell you guys thank you and that we um, can't wait to talk with you again. And I want you guys to please try to be kind to one another. And we will see you again soon. Bye. Bye.